Hey, good afternoon, YouTube gang. It's Mel DFS coming to you live and direct. Here to give you my fave five plays for today's nine game main slate. Feel free to smash that like. Also, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. And if you don't mind, press that bell icon to get notified for future videos or even just notifications on the video. All right, also check me out on my Twitter at Melorama for any updates on my Fade 5. Also, check back into the video, like I said, so you get an updated Fade 5 if someone's out. So, always check back in. If you want access to my player pool, check out my link in the description for the draft dashboard tools. All right, it's only $1 for 30 days, y'all, to get access to my plays for NBA and for MLB. So, let's jump into it, y'all. Going to my first pick, pick at Pitcher. Definitely want to take a look at Zach Wheeler today against Cincinnati. Now he's averaging 21.5 fans points in the past two games versus Cincinnati. All right, he's getting a, he's at a 3.5 implied runs versus him today, averaging 36.2 fans points per game in two variable games, 22.3 fans points a game in the past 20 starts, averaging around 25.7 strike rate. Love this play, as you can see. He's been doing well the past three games: 39 last game, 15-24. Also, with his price tag at the 9300, I uh, love this play. Uh, he's 700 less on FanDuel, but got to go with him with a safe play today uh, with 3.3 RA. Guess the Reds should do work today, so plugging him in. All right, let's go to my first base. All right, going to be targeting uh, the Chicago White Sox stack. So Jose Abreu is in a great spot against Means today. All right, even though Means is a, he's been doing well lately, I feel like he's gonna have an issue with the right right hand batters for today. All right, he had two home runs in the past five games, averaging around 20.3 fans points in the past three games versus Baltimore. He has a 357 batting average, uh, 214 ISO, a 417 WOBA versus left hand pitchers, 17 RBIs in the past 20 games, three home runs, two stolen bases in the past 20 games, going against. Baltimore's bullpen, they allow an average 2.2 fans points per game against the, uh, I mean, a per play appearance against right hand bats. So, definitely love him in this pick at a first baseman at 5,000. 8.5 projection. Check him out as well. All right, 10, 23, 10, 33, 16, 30 in the past five games. Definitely doing work. So, going to plug him in in this play against the uh, Orioles today. Now let's go to second baseman. Now like I said, going to be targeting, um, going to be targeting Chicago White Sox. We're going with Jose Rodon, man. Like I said, in another good spot against Means. He has a 1.43 OPS against right hand bats, y'all. So Jose, he does well against left hand pitches as well. 8.58 OPS against lefties. Should do well. You know, he was 0 for 2 uh, against Means before, but. Should definitely ball out in this play. As you can see in the past three games against Baltimore, 18, 25, 15. He had 17 last game with a home run. So hopefully keep with this flame in this play. All right, so he's averaging 370 batting average, two, uh, 421 Woba, a 222 ISO against left-hand pitchers, averaging 19.3 fans points in the past three games versus Baltimore, and he's at home again. So love that stat knowing he plays well against him at home. and means he gives up an average 1.8 fans points per play appearance against right-hand bats. So love this play. That's 3,800 is a good, safe play. Um, eight. Eight uh, phase point projection play for him today. 1500 left on FanDuel, so it's a great uh, salary safe spot for him today. All right, let's go to uh, let's go to third base. All right, if Howie Kendrick is not playing, he's one, he's one of those guys you definitely want to check the status on. He's confirmed. Uh, so Howie Kendrick is in a smashing spot today. But if he's not playing, I like Alex Bregman today. He's two for six. Going against Minnesota with Oda uh, 333 batting average, one single, one home run against him. Love the spot against him today with a good uh, OPS against right hand batters. Oda Rizzi doesn't do, he, he's average with right hand, uh, right hand batter. So 
to do well against him today. All right, he's at Target Field. That's more of a batter friendly park. Averaging 2.2 fans points per play appearance against right-hand pitchers. Has a, a 415 Woba, a 3 a 310 batting average against right-hand pitchers as well. All right, and going against Odorizzi, he has a, a 333 batting average, a 500 ISO, 557 Woba, two RBIs, and one home run, like I stated before, against Odorizzi. So. Hopefully he can bounce back in this play. He hasn't done well in the past few games, but he should definitely bounce back in this play. So you can see in the past five games, 9, 11, 7, 21, 16 in the past five against Minnesota. So it's a bounce back game for him today. Hopefully he can cash in this spot at 4,700. All right, let's go to outfielders today. Definitely like the New York Mets against the New York Mets. All right, for today against uh, Cincinnati. A going game with uh, Brandon Nimmo. All right, going against Cincinnati in a great position. You can see a 33% uh, advantage play for him. And he does well against Rourke. All right, wind blowing also. The wind is blowing left in their favor today. He's averaging 10.6 fans points in the past five games versus Cincinnati. And he has a 444 batting average versus Rourke. A three, uh, 333 ISOs. 420, uh, 465 Woba, averaging around 2.7 face points in the past. Uh, I'm sorry, 2.7 face points per play appearance versus Rourke with one home run, two RBIs, and a pot spot. But in this play, he has 12. Uh, in this stat, he has 12 in 12 play appearance. He had three singles, one double, one home run with a 417 batting average. But love him in this spot today. Rourke gives up a lot with lefties at a 904 OPS. And as you can see, when Nemo does real good, 834 OPS against right hand, right hand pitchers. But love this play for him today. As you see, he had 9, 9, 10, 10 the past four games, and he had 12 last game against them. So love this spot for him. And if you like my plays, feel free to give me a thumbs up. Any questions or concerns with your lives, feel free to comment below. Also, like I said, check out my Twitter at Melorama for any updates on my Fade 5. Or if you have any questions with your line, feel free to comment below. Check out my Draft Dashboard tools, as you can see, in the link in my description. You sign up for $1 for 30 days. You have access to your sleepers, your studs, player trends. Check out the watch players of your custom player pool. And you'll see Watch Mel's DFS Picks button up top. Click that button. You have access to my plays to help with your custom line. So, love y'all, man. Y'all collect that bag for today. It's Mel DFS. Y'all stay blessed. See y'all in the next video.